Are you looking for a quick overview of all the major condo buildings in downtown St. Pete? Well, stay tuned. Hey there, Paul Fontaine, Keller Williams in St. Pete. Let's start with what doesn't exist yet, because that makes sense, right? In the real estate world, it's called pre-construction, and here's a summary. Currently, there are three major condo buildings in pre-construction phase in downtown St. Pete. By the way, if you'd like my free downtown St. Pete condo slash co-op guide, please email me at the address below. All right, back to condos. Pre-construction. The first is Reflection at 777 3rd Avenue North. It's 81 residences, 18-story building with 12,000 square foot amenity rooftop, fitness center and social club, a tropical pool and a spa terrace, and an outdoor kitchen and a wet bar. The price ranges are 800,000 plus. Their pet policy is a two pet limit. There's no maximum weight and it can be leased. The completion is 2023 and 2024. The second pre-construction is Domus Urbana at 644 3rd Avenue South. It's 40 residences, five-story mid-rise building. Price range is $450,000 to $600,000. Amenities include community room, fitness center, a dog park, parking. Maximum weight for your dog is 75 pounds and the units can be leased. Completion date is mid-2022. Number three is called the Julia, which is 100 400 Avenue North. It's 15 residences, so a small building, 18-story building. Price range is 1.1 million plus. Amenities are parking, a few different pools, a sky bar on the roof, and a terrace. There's no maximum weight for pets, and the units can be leased. The completion is early 2023. Now moving on to condo buildings that are under construction, but haven't been finished or occupied yet. There are two major buildings in downtown St. Pete. And just a reminder, if you'd like my free downtown St. Pete condo slash co-op guide, email me at the address below. All right, now under construction. Number one is the Salt Air at 301 First Street South. The completion date is June 2023. It's a 35-story building. The developer is Coulter Urban, and the price range is $850,000 to over $7 million. Amenities include garage parking, swimming pool, fitness center. Maximum weight for your puppy dogs is 100 pounds and the units can be leased. Number two is Vela, which is 424 8th Street South. Completion is 2022. It's a smaller building at eight stories. It has 18 corner units. Developer is Kali International and the price range is 500,000 plus. Amenities are common roof deck and lounge. There's a fitness center, a courtyard, and of course parking. 100 pound weight for your puppy dog and can be leased. All right, onto buildings that actually exist and people live in them. I'll start with the newer ones built after the year 2000. There are definitely a lot of these, so I'll just quickly mention. Some newer construction is one St. Petersburg at 100 First Avenue North, built in 2018, 41 stories, gorgeous building, great amenities, outdoor kitchen, 5,000 square foot fitness center, price range is 900,000 plus, two pet limit, Number two is Bliss Condos at 176 4th Avenue Northeast, built in 2017. It's 19 stories, price range is 1 million plus, includes a heated pool, rooftop, terrace, etc. Roll in Place, which is 146 4th Avenue Northeast, built in 2015. It's a six story building with 17 residences, built by JMC Communities, price range 1 million plus. Another one is the Ovation Condos, 178-80 Beach Drive Northeast, built in 2009. It's 28 story, 45 resident places with the price range of 2 million plus. 400 Beach Drive, built in 2007, price range 900,000 plus. It's a 25 story building, concierge, parking, gym, pool, etc. Vinoy Place at 555 Fifth Avenue Northeast, built in 2001, 14 story building. Price range is 1.5 million plus. The Sage, which is 404th Avenue South. It's a mid-rise built in 2007. It's two buildings between fifth floor and 11th floor. Has pool, fitness center, media room, club room. Price ranges are 375,000 plus, so a little bit more affordable. The Walker Whitney Plaza, which is 226 Fifth Avenue North, built in 2007. 14 story building, large building, rooftop deck with grills. Price ranges are 450,000 plus. The pet weight for this one is actually 50 pounds. Signature Place at 175 First Street South, built in 2009, 34 stories. Price range 400,000 plus. McNulty Lofts at 175 Second Street South, used to be the old St. Pete Firehouse. It was rebuilt in 2006, 13 stories. 400,000 plus is the price range. 
Salvador Condos at 199 Dolly Boulevard, built in 2017. It's a 12-story building with a gated dog park area and dog washing. Price range is 450,000 plus. Now let's discuss some oldie but goodie condo buildings built in the 1900s. There's Bayfront, which is at One Beach Drive, built in 1975, 28-story building, 24-7 Valley Parking Concierge Fitness Center on the 29th floor. Price range for this is 450,000 plus. Beacon, which is at 470 Third Street South, it was built in 1965. It's 11 stories, really beautiful views, a nice common roof deck, and it has covered and uncovered parking spots. $150,000 plus is the price range there, so pretty affordable. And there's Bay Barrow Towers, which is 210 Fifth Avenue South, built in 1974. It's just a four-story building. $160,000 plus is the price range. Two pet limit. Shorecrest Condos at 1200 North Shore Drive, Northeast. This is a 55 plus building, it's a six story building, around $300,000 plus is the price range. And lastly, I wanted to separate the co-ops versus condos. If you aren't sure what a co-op is, send me an email below and I'll be more than happy to explain. And as always, just remember, if you'd like my free downtown St. Pete condo and co-op guide, please email me. Below is a list of some of the co-ops. Many of them are 55 plus age buildings. Some of them can be leased and some of them cannot be. Many of these were built in the 1950s, 1960s. With co-ops, the prices tend to be a little bit lower, sometimes $150,000 or more. Okay, I know that was a lot. If you're looking to relocate to Florida or you want to downsize to a downtown St. Pete Condor, just remember to call Paul. Have a great day. Bye-bye.